What do you call a zombie that doesn't joke around? Dead serious. <laughs> Awful, I know. Don't forget, comment your dad jokes down below. Right, so hello again, everybody. Welcome back. A quick video today, but a lot of people have been asking how you can adjust audio on a fire stick. And this could be for something as simple as the lips not matching the sound. Right, so that being said, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And let's crack on. Right, so I'm going to try and keep this video short and sweet. I don't want to waste too much of your time. So, I'm on the Fire Stick 4K Max, but it's going to work the same on any Amazon device. If I go across to Settings, and then I'm going to go to where it says Display and Audio. Once you click on this, you're going to see you've got a few different options. The one we're going to click on is Audio. Now, once you've clicked on this, you've got Navigation Sounds. This is where you can turn those off if you don't like the clicking noise. You can see what the surround sound is set as. Now, a lot of people did find joy with out-of-sync audio just by changing these options here. But personally, it's something I've never done. Now, advanced audio, this is something I've seen on the Cube for a while, but it's not something I've always noticed on the Fire Stick. And you've got a volume leveler and a dialogue enhancer. Now, what these do is sets a consistent volume level across your streaming content and apps, which could be really good because if you're watching something like a war film, and they're talking pretty quiet, and then all of a sudden, there's bombs going off, or there's planes flying over, and it's like, wow, that's loud. And you're constantly turning it up and down. Maybe this is something that will help. The dialogue enhancer, this boosts the vocals to make it easier to understand the dialogue. Once again, might be something to stop that turning it up and down. Now, these are something you can just flick on and off there. But I will be honest, this is something I've tried and I didn't really notice any difference. Maybe it's only in supported apps, I'm not sure. But let me know in the comments section down below if it works well for you. And something else we've got in here is one of the main ones is AV Sync Tuning. Now, if I click on this, what you're going to see... That ball keeps bouncing and it's making a, a bleeping noise. Now, if you find that that's out of sync, so let's just click over here. And now you can see it's not matching. This is where you can adjust it to make it correct and to fix out of sync audio. Now, this is something that did work for me because I'm using a soundbar in the house and I found that there was a slight delay on the audio. So I was able just to adjust that and then it fixed it. So that's just the audio section. A lot of people weren't aware that was there in the settings on your Fire Stick. And then if you want as well, you've also got audio and video diagnostics, so you can take a look in there to get a bit more information. Now, sometimes this won't fix it for everybody, so you can look at the settings on the TV to see if you can adjust it there. You can also get external players like MX Player or VLC, or even if you use KODI, can't say it properly because YouTube don't like it, you can put an audio delay on those as well. But let me know in the comment section down below, have you ever had an issue with audio? Has it ever been out of sync? What did you do to fix it? And if there's anything I've not mentioned in this video... Other people can look at the comments and it might help them out. But yeah, it's one of those videos that does sound pretty basic, but there are a lot of Fire Stick users out there that are newcomers and beginners, and they're always looking for new ways to adjust their streaming device. So I thought I'd make this video today. Right, so that being said, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. And I'll see you soon. ta -da.